are insurgents uh, trying to regroup in the hill state? Are there a sizable number of armed cadres still running extortion rackets in the state's Garo Hills region? Well, one person was killed in an encounter with police in West Garo Hills headquarters at Tura last evening. The encounter took place when the deceased, who was on a bike, opened fire at the cops after he was directed to stop. What is also concerning is the revelation by West Garo Hills Police that uh, prior to the encounter, it received credible information regarding suspicious movement of unidentified persons with sophisticated weapons in and around the Dalga Daldagre area. And accordingly, a counter-insurgency operation was immediately launched and multiple nakas were put to apprehend the miscreants. As per the police statement, at around 7.30pm yesterday, a police team at one of the nakas noticed a bike rider approaching. On seeing the police team, the rider allegedly jumped off the bike and also opened fire. However, the assailant sustained bullet injuries during the encounter and succumbed to the injuries later. Meanwhile, while confirming the incident, Chief Minister Konrad Sangma said that the investigation is underway to ascertain the identity of the slain individual. Well, it is yet to be ascertained if the deceased has links with any particular group. Yesterday, we have seen the, uh, yeah, uh, the official report, uh, I have not seen, as I said, I came straight to the uh, session. But uh, the preliminary information that came to me, uh, was that, uh, that there was an information that was received by the uh, West Caro Hills Police that uh, there were uh, some movement of arms uh, and the information came in that it will uh, come uh, in that particular route. Accordingly, the police had put up a NACA checking and uh, in that process, uh, when that happened, the uh, individual came in a bike uh, with a very heavy bag at the back and uh, immediately he got off and took out the weapon and fired a few rounds and uh, luckily the police also was uh, there uh, prepared for any kind of situation and uh, when they retaliated uh, that's when uh, I think the, uh, the, uh, the bullets hit the concerned individual and he succumbed uh, to the injuries so more investigation is going on on the details and uh, what for the background situation that uh, and what are the connections that are there so those facts are not uh, the, the reports are still being collected so once that comes in then uh, the home minister or the department will come out with a proper statement on that <laughs>